All right, what's up, everybody? It's Boy Kenny now today. Today, today. <laughs> Listen, I got some funny stuff to show to you guys today. First of all, shout out to Charlie Intel for always, you know, providing the intel and always providing the information for, you know, the up, uh, up and coming Call of Duty, uh, which is, you know, Call of Duty Black Ops 6. Was I'm, you know, I'm really excited about the game. I played the beta, which is really, you know, I'm gonna be honest with you. I wasn't, even, I wasn't even expecting the beta to be like, to be like really good, but. If I'm being completely honest with you, bro, the beta definitely blew me away. Um, like, it, bro, the game is very addicting. Is it cheesy? Yes. Is it very fast-paced? Yes. But that's just Black Ops style. You know, that's just what it is. You know, I'm not really going to sit here and complain about the style of Black Ops. And to be honest with you, I do like Modern Warfare just better. I mean, I've been a, I've been like a Modern Warfare kid for like 10 plus years, but I can't lie to you, bro. My style of like play uh, definitely fits with Black Ops. So I'm going to definitely have a lot of fun whenever that game comes out on the 25th and so yeah when listen we're not here to talk about specifically the gameplay we're going to talk about um a lot of the other settings and mechanics about the game <laughs> so listen uh this might be a short video it might be like a little medium little video eight minute video whatever uh 10 minute video 15 minute i, I don't know i might i'm just going to just ramble so here we go Call of Duty Black Ops 6. Again, we're not going to talk about the campaign we're not going to sit here and talk about the multiplayer zombies whatever you want to call it we're going to talk about, um, like, the voice chat settings. Now, if I'm being honest with you, right, um, I've been playing this game. I'm, I've been playing Call of Duty just itself for, what, 10-plus years, ever since I was little. Um, you know, I've heard the worst of the worst things. You know, I'm a black kid, so, of course, you know, I heard the I heard the N-word, you know. Uh, I heard the C-word. Like, yeah, like, listen, I... I'm not going to say those words. You know, listen, if I say those words and, you know, your boy is, it, listen, no, no monetization for me. Um, so, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to say those words. But uh, let's just say those words are, are definitely um, along the likes of, you know, racism. Um, it is what it is. It's fine. Like, I can take it. Like, I never really complained about it. I thought, to be honest with you, I always thought it was funny. Now, listen, don't strip my black card just because I laugh at just because I laugh at somebody calling me the N-word, and I laugh at it. Don't, listen, don't don't take my black card just yet. Because, of course, you know, I will return fire, too. Listen, at the end of the day, I was still dropping 30, 40, 50 kills on these, uh, on these old dads coming home. And to be fair, bro, a lot of these dads, bro, they were just trying to play the game. They wouldn't really call me anything. It was more of like the kids, they were like older than me, probably like uh, like teenagers, you know, call me all types of words, whatever. The dads on the game back then were actually pretty cool. And I think, the, here's the thing, right? The dads that play the game like like then and now, bro, are actually still pretty cool. It, it, it's the, you know, the, you know, the early teenagers, you know, they're wild or whatever. You know, you know how it is. So listen, your boy was dropping 30, 40 a night like, like I'm LeBron James. Uh, I was absolutely going off. Of course, you know you're gonna get these people like, "Oh my God, he's cheating!" He gave the control to his other, to uh, to his older brother. Uh, he he plugged in some type of device. Like, he gotta be cheating. Like, I, I, listen, I got hit with all types of accusations. To be honest with you, I really think I should have signed up for these. But you know, it is what it is. You know. But um, listen. Speaking of like the voice chat, uh, listen, I, I've heard it all. You know, <laughs> I've heard it all. Uh, I've been called every single word under the sun in voice chat and stuff like that. Um, so now, now this is, you know, listen, this is a trusted source, Charlie Intel. Shout out to uh, Charlie Intel for, for uh, providing the, you know, the, the intel. You know, shout out to him for always. Listen, everything he says, bro, happens. It, and that's just what it is. You know, like he's the, he's the boy. Whenever it comes to intel for Call of Duty, bro, he is the guy. He is the Clark Kent. He is he is the D, he's the DJ academics. He is the lowest lane. Like bro, he has the scoop. If I'm just being honest with you. So, all right, here's what it says. I'm gonna read this word for word, and you tell me what you guys think about this. I'm gonna tell you what I think, obviously. But um, so it says Black Ops Six <laughs> will have voice chat moderation. <laughs> One second. Listen, listen. Don't, look, don't laugh. You're gonna make me mess up. Don't laugh. Black Ops 6 will have voice chat moderation and in-game text chat moderation at launch. Okay. There has been a 67% reduction in toxic voice chat <laughs> with the new detection tools across Call of Duty. It will expand to cover French, German, alongside of English, Spanish, and Portuguese. Guess what? You can't call me nothing. Listen, you can't, listen, you can't say nothing toxic in German. 
You can't call me nothing in English. You can't you can't you can't call me any any Spanish cuss words. I know a few. You can't call me nothing. You you, you can't even French your way out of this. You can't even call me nothing in, in, in a French language. It's over. It's over. They say it's a 67. Bro, we got all types of tools to block out any word. Any word we can see. Now, to be honest with you, right? Um, I still think that, you know, we're still going to be toxic. And when I say weird, that means me, you, and everybody else when we hop in this game. That's just, it is what it is. Um, and, and that's just it. We don't, listen, I'm going to be completely honest with you. I've always disagreed with Call of Duty whenever it came down to this. Like, listen, like, real stuff, real stuff, real stuff, real stuff. I promise. No, but like real stuff, like we've all, and I promise you when I say this, we've all said like some, some harsh things to, you know, to the opponent that we've never met before in our life. They, bro, we could be in New York. They could live in like in Antarctica, bro. No matter what, we're trading blows. We're trading virtual blows. It is what it is. My thing is I've always disagreed with Call of Duty whenever it came to this. And it was the whole thing of like, oh, let's be family friendly. Even whenever like you, uh, even like whenever you log into the game. Of like Modern Warfare 3, they'll give you the message of, hey guys, like, you know, code and honor, you know, let's not say any bad things, you know, guys, let's just be positive. And I'm all for being a positive guy. I, I do love a positive outlook on life. But at the end of the day, like, you know, at, like, <laughs> let's just say this, right? Whenever I get on the mic, I don't start nothing. I, I swear, bro, I swear to you, I don't start nothing. If they say something, you know I'm returning back fire. That it, it is what it is, right? At the end of the day, bro, this is Call of Duty. This is a game where we shoot people. Okay, I, I want you to understand this. Call of Duty, please don't get mad at me. I, let me just break this down. And Call of Duty, you know I love you. Call of Duty, why would I not love you? I've been playing you, bro. I've been playing your game for 10 plus years. At the end of the day, what I'm trying to explain is that this is a game where we shoot people, bro. This is a game where... We execute people and like do all types of moves to the to uh, to the other person. This is a game where, um, bro. This is a game where you know Makarov and his goons, Makarov and, and and the rest of his custodians walked into an elevator, walked out the elevator, and then lit everybody up like the Fourth of July. At the end of the day, this is a game. This is this is a game about technically about murder. If you want to be really technical and and whatever. Obviously, it is a video game, but at the end of the day, bro, us not being able to curse, us not being able to, you know, um, you know, trash talk or whatever, I really feel like that's a little lame if you're asking me, you know, um, because why not? Why not? We're planning, like, and I understand you want everybody to be, to, uh, be respectful, but at the end of the day, brother, we're in 2024. We're in 2024. Where was this 10 years ago? Where was this rule 15 years ago where, oh, you got to be respectful to your opponent. Oh, you got to be respectful to the other team. Brother, what? I, bro, I was nine years old getting called the N-word. Who cares? I'm, and I'm just, and listen, I'm, being, I'm just being honest. I'm just being honest, bro. As a black kid, bro, as somebody that's, bro, I got called the N-word so many times when I was younger, bro, playing Call of Duty. It, it, bro, who cares? Bro, I never in my life ever. Uh, took that to heart. I was like, oh my god, he hurt my feelings. Like, bro, ne who cares? I'm never, bro, I'm never going to see that guy again, ever. Who cares? He called me the N-word. Cool. And I move on to the next match. I queue on to the next match. <laughs> that's, bro, that's just what it was, bro. And, and, and maybe, you know, listen, I understand, bro. Times are different now. Times are different, you know. Um, I, I guess, you know, you know, for something, I don't know. Listen, I don't want to get too political or whatever, but, you know, I guess times is different. You know, some shows, we allow it. Some some TV, some movies, we, we, we don't allow it. Video games, oh, my God, video games are just too... Like, bro, do y'all remember that one thing, uh, like, back in the day where they was like, oh, well, um, I think if, you're, if your kid plays video games, it could lead to them being uh, this, 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 bro, they really tried to, like, vilify video games back then, it was crazy, bro, like, it, bro, it was down bad, the way they tried to make it seem, the way, they, I think they, what did they say, I think they said, oh, if you play Call, oh, no, my bad, it was about GTA 5, GTA 5 came out, and the news people were like, oh, my God, um, so Grand Theft Auto, you know, even though this game generated a billion dollars in the first day, this game can be really, really bad for your, bad for your kid's mental health, John, uh, 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 let's talk to John for more information. And then, you know, John 
will pull any bro john will just pull anything from wikipedia and try to make himself seem smart and then say like a bunch of buzzwords to try to like you know scare the parents into not like it was crazy bro. they tried to vilify video games so crazy but then like you put on these little whack shows that these kids don't want to watch like bro at the end of the day that's just what it is bro kid like these are video games bro i'm, I'm sorry that most normal kids just play the game and whenever somebody says something towards them they say it right back I like that. I'm going to be honest with you, bro. Like, 10 years down the line, whatever, whenever I have a kid and he's playing a game or she's playing a game, and, like, and, and, and you know, my kid's talking that ish to the other kid, bro, I'm going to be in another room like a proud dad, bro, clapping. I'm going to be like a proud dad, bro, because I'm like, dang, bro, my kids did the same thing I did, like, 20, 30 years ago. Like, why? Listen, and I'm not saying, and, and somebody probably going to twist my words, I'm not saying kids should just be cussing. No, I'm not <laughs> I'm not saying that. I'm just saying whenever, you know, we're playing a game, bro, and we're and like we're in like our own little bubble, bro, and we're trash talking to each other. What's wrong with that? I don't listen, me personally, I don't see nothing wrong with that, especially for a game. Like I could see if it was NBA 2K. If NBA 2K was like, "Okay, guys, like, you know, we're putting this restriction on uh voice chat, you know, if you say a bad word or if you say a cuss word, then the AI will pick it up within the system and like block you from voice chat, whatever." All right, cool. I mean, cool basketball game. The game is ready to eat for everyone, you know, because it's a basketball game. Great. Okay, fine. You can have it. But Call of Duty, the game that's rated M for mature, that we can't curse? Like, what are we? Like, what are we? And I'm going to be honest with you. I don't even, I don't curse like that in real life. I promise you. I don't curse like, I don't curse like that in real life. But guess what? On that game, I will curse. <laughs> On that game, that's where, bro, a bunch of stuff is flying out. I'm going to be, especially, bro, especially if people are coming at me. Oh, yeah, you're done. I promise you. You're, you're getting violated. I'm just, listen, I'm just being honest. I'm, I got to be real with you, okay? And so I find it kind of funny how, you know, this is 67% reduction in, um, in, 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 in the hate speech and disrespectful speech of cussing and stuff like that in an M-rated game. Again, I can see in Fortnite. Um, NBA 2K, any sports games, uh, like I said, Fortnite, cool. They put a little thing on a voice chat. You can't cuss, great. But on an M, bro, come on, bro. But on Call of Duty, a game where we're murdering people, come on, bro. Like, let let let's you know, let's really think about this. Like, I I don't, I don't get it, I, bro. Like, and it's fun. It's fun that way, bro. Especially when it's like search and destroy. You got your squad, and it's the other squad. And each round, you guys get to like just go at each other, or whatever. And the, and the mic, like, in the mic, you hear like ten different voices, and everybody's going, hey, bro, hey, bro. The, the vibes are up, like the energy's up, like, bro, like, and then like you want to win the next round so you can talk your ish to the next person, like, bro. That's, oh man, like that's the that's the vibes, that's the vibes that we all like. And so Call of Duty, bro. I, listen, I don't like that, man. I'm just keeping it real, bro. I don't like that, bro. I don't call of duty. I love y'all, bro, and I I'm, I'm really looking forward to Black Ops Six, but I'm not looking forward to that at all. That sounds lame. That sounds boring. Um, that that sounds that sounds confusing. Like you know, again, we're playing a game where we murder people, but we can't cuss like that. Okay, you know it is what it is. But maybe, listen, <laughs> who am I? I'm just the guy that sits here and talks about video games. I'm listen. Who am I though? You know it is what it is. You know, so I, I listen. No matter what, I'm going to tell you guys at the end of the day, I'm going to tell you guys right now, and I'm going to tell you guys again five years from now, and then five years from now, I'm going to tell you guys uh, ten years from now. At the end of the day, no matter what, I'm going to always tell you how I truly feel, no matter what, and and that's just it, you know, so um, if some people from Call of Duty want to, you know, disagree, whatever they can, but comment down below, man, what do you guys think about this? Truly, I really want you guys, like, opinion on this. What do you guys think about this whole 67 reduction in uh, voice speech and stuff like that with the voice, with uh, with the mic and stuff like that? It's confusing, I mean. Uh, see you guys later, man. Hopefully you guys have a, a good rest of the night, morning, evening, uh, uh, um, 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 nap, whatever you're doing, bro. Shout out to you guys for watching. And...